In this video, I don't know how I managed to pull it off, but I managed to host the biggest Yu-Gi-Oh! tournament in history of the world. Now, we're not Yu-Gi-Oh! pros here. I got a bunch of big, chungus, epic, mad lad content creators that haven't played Yu-Gi-Oh! in years to relive their childhood and play OG Yu-Gi-Oh! by opening random packs, creating decks, all dueling, in a massive four-hour-long live-streamed tournament with eight competitors, two official Yu-Gi-Oh! judges, and people with collective viewership more than any other Yu-Gi-Oh! tournament that ever existed. <laughs> the official Yu-Gi-Oh! Konami people should, like, take down notes. They, they should hire me for their shiz, okay? <laughs> if I don't mean to brag. And you want to know the even crazier thing? I'm already planning an episode two. The, the second one's going to be even bigger. I, I got people like... Carl Jacobs, Moist Critical, freaking Chilled Chaos, all these epic gamers that saw how insane this was and are down to clown in a sequel, which is gonna be even bigger. Follow me on Twitch to actually catch it live whenever it happens. Link in the description, twitch.tv slash Nuxtaku. It's gonna be huge. But for now, allow me to introduce you to something truly amazing that I've put together. And if you don't really know how to play Yu-Gi-Oh, the enjoyment factor, the clash of these different people, was just completely mind-blowing. For the eight competitors, we had me, Nugstaku, also Briggs, who I actually was inspired to start doing this with because Briggs and I have been doing a weekly Yu-Gi-Oh! series for the last couple of weeks on my second channel, Nuxanor. Definitely check it out. Dan TDM, an absolute legend that I've been watching forever, and he's one of my inspirations for starting this, to be honest. I don't think he even realizes how much he inspired me. I was kind of putting this thing together, and all of a sudden he tweets at me saying, Hey, Nux, I found you in a Yu-Gi-Oh! card, and it's a trap card. And then my subreddit started posting memes about animate traps because you guys have an amazing sense of humor. My boy Swag Kage, the legend Tectone, Merry Weathery, Zentreya, and Teching 101. These eight competitors would open 100 packs of virtual Yu-Gi-Oh cards, create decks from OG cards only, and then duel their hearts out. For the two judges, I got Farfa and Distant Coder, epic Yu-Gi-Oh! streamer pro extraordinaires, and they did commentary and rulings and all sorts of crazy stuff. You have no idea how massive this was. I don't know how, but I managed to put together something that I don't think has ever been seen before. Getting a bunch of just big casuals playing in a massive tournament like this. It's been crazy. And after the tournament ended, Dan TDM actually messaged me. He was like, hey, if you throw a Pokemon tournament together, I'd be down. And I was like, oh, my heart break and crack. I was so honored. All right, he's going to watch this video back and he's going to see how much of a simp I am. And then, then you know, he's maybe he's going to cut ties with me. It's going to be rough. But I want to keep hosting just massive tournaments in all these different areas and fields. And <sighs> thank you for being along with me on the ride, goddammit. And thank you to G Fuel for making this kind of thing possible. G Fuel is an epic energy drink that's calorie free. It energizes you. It tastes amazing. And you can get 10 to 30% off your order by just using code NUX or clicking the link in the description below. They help me so much. They make my dreams come true. But you know who else makes my dreams come true? All of you guys for watching this thing unfold. So I hope you're ready to witness actual history. And I hope you're ready to subscribe. Smash that goddamn notification bell. Leave a like on the video. Because not only am I hosting future tournaments of massive proportions in different fields, but... Yu-Gi-Oh! Part 2, baby. It's gonna have 16 competitors. It's gonna be even bigger, badder, and better. The future is goddamn here. I hope you enjoyed this heavily edited masterpiece of a tournament from all the eight perspectives and the two judges. Link to everyone that competed and participated in the description, of course. And now let's just jump right into it. The day has arrived! Oh my god! The biggest Yu-Gi-Oh! tournament in the history of the world. Yes, I have done it because I am a legend. But before we jump right into that, allow me to let you know that today, August 17th, my brand new plushie in collaboration with U2's drops. It's so cute and fluffy, I can die. A lot of you have been asking me for this kind of thing, and it is here. But unfortunately, there is a limited stock. It is not here to stay. And by tomorrow, it will almost definitely be completely sold out. Do what you can as quickly as possible. Click the link in the description. Go get some fluffy plushie Nuxanor. God damn it.
limited supply, limited drops. Honestly, like I did a figurine with you twos like a year ago, it got sold out immediately. And they are currently selling for like five times the price on eBay. So, I mean, think of it as an investment as well. Pick some up while you can, because you won't for long. You twos plushie, let's get it gamers. Link in the description. And now onto the greatness that is the video. You how, like, how are we doing you today, get, gamers? You just get used to it. What up, Sorry, boy? Oh, hi, hello, doing? hi, hello. What's what up? On? This is gonna be insane. Oh, I'm my so God. excited, dude. Yo, I am so excited for this. It's crazy. Yeah, I haven't slept much to be honest. <laughs> oh my God. The way the tournament is designed is. On the website, yugiohprodeck.com, we will open 100 virtual packs of early Yu-Gi-Oh, meaning everything up till GX era. We will then put a deck together in duelingbook.com, and we will then duel in an eight-person tournament bracket royale. No bans, no limited, everything's at three. Everything's right? at three. Okay. And, and that's it. So I guess I'll all see right. you all here at four. All right, then. Good luck, yes, gamers. Good, good luck, duelists. Good luck. Bye. Bye. Let's do this. Uh, I'm going with Gravekeepers. That is the first major archetype in all of Yu-Gi-Oh! And they are found here, over here in Pharaonic Guardian. Hoo -hoo! Am I nervous? Yes. Am I terrified? Only a little. I think I'm going to be going for the Pharaonic Guardian pack. Pharaonic Guardian, as you all may be aware of, has one of my favorite strategies, the Pac-Man strategy. So I want to be going for something like this. And uh, it also has Rejeki break in common, which will be very clutch. So I'm gonna pull from this until I could get my three commons, three sets of all the commons. That's really what I'm gonna be going for. Gamers, I'm lucky now. So I am gonna get all the cards that I want. Are you ready? Oh my God, I'm terrified. I'm terrified, ah! All right, all right. The plan is simple. In Yu-Gi-Oh, there are winners and losers. Everyone I happen to face against just happens to be losers. Game, set, match, let's go. Nux, I don't know how to fucking do this. Oh, that's Kind of trash. We'll see. Do I right. do I gotta do I gotta do I gotta register or no? Okay, I'll register because I'm not smart. All right, let so, me. Uh, can, can I go back to opening cards, please? I guess I'll figure it out. Whatever. Techie is dying. We're all dying. Swarm of scarabs. Let's go. Let's go. Want a swarm of scarabs? Yeah, magic. I think magic ruler and legend of blue eyes is is good. Just putting that out there. Because there's Solemn Judgment in Magic Ruler. There is Pot of Greed in Legend of Blue Eyes. But in Legend of Blue Eyes, there are not many good monster cards. So I'm going for a fucking annoying deck, because I know Nux will too. So the only way for me to beat his level of annoyance is to be even more annoying. The reason why I'm starting with Invasion of Chaos is because I would like to pull a Burb. I need three Burbs though. I might throw. You can win. You feel great. You can do this. Yeah, Raigeki Break is good. Two Raigeki Breaks already. That's that's a good trap card. I'm not doubting that. There's Great Keeper. Oh, yes, yes. That's a coffin. That's, that's a coffin seller and a Gravekeeper's Chief. Okay, good. Dark Hole. Nice, nice. Trap Hole is good. So we're gonna open up some Magic Ruler. Okay, Toll is pretty good too. I might play a burn deck. I don't know. Toll and Chain Energy might be what we want. These are not good pulls. A Horus deck? I don't know. <gasps> Cybertar! Bless. Bless, 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 bless. Pog, 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 pog. Okay, we got a Cyber Jar, so we're already doing okay. Woo! Swarm of Scarabs. Amazing balls. Beautiful. Pot of Greed, baby. I think, I think we need to do Metal Raiders. Heavy Storm! Let's go! Heavy Storm, baby! Let's go! Okay, that's big. That's big, dude. Okay, okay. Man to Bug, that's good. Raigeki is banned. No, we can have three. We can have three. This is good, Man a Bug. Terraforming is good. That'll allow us to get Necro Valley from our deck to our hand, provided we draw the damn card we need. Okay. Give me something big. Phoenix Windblast, sick. Another Threatening Roar, enormous. 
We're, we're doing good. We're doing good. We're getting some big picks right now, dude. New Doria, Spy, Camel, right, Jackie Break. Oh my God, this pack has the sauce. I need Pot of Greed, Swords of Revealing Light. These packs suck. Oh, yes. We got Swords of Revealing Light. That's good. That's good. That's good. All right, so I'm kind of getting, kind of getting hold on right now, but I really want to get some Mystic Tomato or Giant Rat. Sorry that I sound low energy. I don't feel- OH MY GOD! <laughs> Holy shit. I pulled Imperial Order. Stealth Bird, I got one. I got one. Realistically, so I actually have a deck built here. If I can pull three of these, and three of these, and three of these, the deck is made, everything else is whatever. In the next pack! <laughs> Alright, Deslacuda and Nudoria. Oh, I already have three, so whatever. Yo, I, don't, I only have one swarm of scarabs. I need more swarm of locusts. I need more pyramid turtles. I want some spirit reapers. Yo, this pack has so much, so much stuff. It has so much stuff, guys. Jesus Christ, man. Give me something big. Rescue cat poggers. Insect knight. Dude, a four star with 1900 attack. That's big enough, dude. Chaos emperor dragon. Oh my God. Fuck. Do I do it? I put it in. Oh my god. What the fuck? I don't even want it. It's post errata. Ah, fuck the rules. I have money. Bro, I can't I pull the Chaos Emperor Dragon. That's fucked. That's actually fucked. Yeah, Metal Raiders is probably good. Metal Raiders has a lot of really good cards. And I need some beaters too, so. Okay, we already got Witch of the Black Forest, so we're already doing really, really well. I think Metal Raiders has Solemn Judgment in it, so I feel like we should go for Metal Raiders as well. Which of the Black Forest is good? Harpy Ladies? We can do Harpy Ladies. Wait. This seems simple. Can I, must first be someone with Ellie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We should do this. We should do Harpies. That's something we can do. Sangan. Good. Change of Heart. Yes. That's good. You literally just take a monster. That's so good. All right. Let me try Invasion of Chaos. See if I can get anything. Oh, panic. Much panic. Quack. Listen, All right. Zen. So there's All of that. This doesn't matter. If you GIO taught me right. anything, one last it's one. that cards and decks do not matter. You just gotta believe in the heart of the cards and you'll always win. Or was it spleen? One of those, I'm sure. Which cards and decks do matter? Fuck you. Barry's got all the Necro Valleys. Come on, Barry! Come on, Barry, Barry. If there was ever a time to access all of your power, all of your divine might, now would be the time, man. Ray of Destruction! Okay! Okay, that's good! That's a secret rare! I Are you shitting me? Are you shitting me with this? Another Ring of Destruction! Okay! Okay! Whatever! It'll go in the deck! I have two of them. Yes! Yes! 51! Lucky number 51! All right, thank God! Give me a burb. Give it to me! That's what it's all about, baby! 25 packs. We are stopping here. We are stopping here. That's it. 25 packs, three burbs, one smashing ground. Money. Money. We keep going! I want my swarm of locusts. Where are they? Ring of destruction! <gasps> That's a good card. That's a good card. That's a good card. And another scarabs. Locusts! <laughs> Please! It's a common! Nothing. Nothing. What is this bad luck? What is this bad luck? I just need some RNG, man, or else this, this deck's gonna fucking suck. Okay, we're gonna continue to be stupid for a little bit. I know, I know, I know. Please don't be mad at me. We're only 25 packs in though. So 10 more packs. We're actually gonna go for wave motion cannon with chaos. <laughs> so we're going magician's force. Wave motion cannon, baby. That's what it's all about. Hi, pipe, pipe. Right here. Give me another one. Give me another one. That's koala. Huge, huge. Okay, but we can move on for now. 
Are there like no locusts in this pack? Is there a glitch? Is this a glitch? Locusts! Oh! <laughs> my bugs! Oh! 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 It's not even a great card. I just need it. Oh my god. Finally. Okay. All right. We keep going. More locusts. We keep going. Another wall of revealing light. Yes, 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 yes. It's all coming together. Level limit area B. And another night assailant, which I probably won't use, but whatever. I want gravity binds. Yes, I will have an annoying deck, but it's the only way. We just need stuff that works together. I'm just staying old, staying what I know, you know. We've got six packs left. Come on. Dark hole. Yes. That's good. That destroys all monsters. That's a good one. Let's do, yeah, let's do Pharaoh's Servant. Let's see if we get a Genzo. Morphing jar number two, dude! Poggers! Okay, 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 okay. More, another morphing jar of Poggers. Imperial Order. Wait, is an Imperial Order fucking broken? Negate all spell effects in the field. Once returned during standby phase, you must pay 700 LP. That's a good one, no? Isn't that fucking sick? That could be fucking huge for me, dude. That could be fucking huge. God tier? Okay. All right, come on. Come on. Swarm of locusts. Huge. Huge. Chat, you don't realize something. My brain is so big, I know I'm unlucky. And I, since I know that I have terrible luck, I decided I was gonna go ahead and build decks out of common poopy PP cards. And with those common poopy PP cards, I will build a deck so annoying. It will carry me to victory. Sounds like a good plan. Sell five. I'm awesome. Oh, this is going to be so hard. So we know we have Pot of Greed. We've got two. We've got two of them. Too many of bugs. Bop, bop. Oh, I don't know what to do, guys. So if it comes down to it, we're just going to go for the, this troll card, all right? We're going to go for these trolls right here. Hinatama. Tremendous fire. Cards like that. Fairy, lend me all of your power. Exodia, give me all of your divine power. And let's draw a Jinzo here. Cyberjar! Yes! Ta! That's a big one. Cyberjar's a big one. We know that one. We know that one. That's a big one. Chaos Sorcerer! We need to run that. Chaos Sorcerer is nuts. Chaos Sorcerer is nuts if if we can build a deck around him. What was that crazy fucking card we got? Uh, it was the card that like everybody was popping off for. Insect Knight. We'll run two of them. It was uh, Imperial Order. We had one of these. How many dark holes do I have? Just one. Crap. Trap hole is good. I want that. Nux's de deck is cancer. He's doing scarabs, isn't he? That's my guess. Oh, I have three. I have three roulette barrels. Let's go. That's huge. Just defense. Defense and wave motion cannons. That's it. Nux tournament. Okay. So, first of all, we gotta put in Cyber Char. Oh, we're gonna bypass on that. I pulled one Cyber Char, so. 
We got four copies of Curse. Guard is good. We're gonna. We're definitely probably gonna do three copies of Guard. All right. What about uh, Ring of Destruction? We have that. We have two copies of that. Okay. And this isn't permanent. This is just me building a deck right now. Right of Spirit is good for you. Um, time Seal. Oh shit. That's right. We got Time Seal. Time Seal's definitely going in there. Yeah. That's forbidden. All right. All right. All right. I want to keep Secret Barrel, though. I wanted to use Secret Barrel. Part of this is competitive. Part of this is also for me to have fun. Uh, so I want to... It's not a great deck. It's like, no, it's not. <laughs> but uh, it's my deck. It's my deck. Thank I think we should add Chaos Emperor Dragon just for the memes. I think we're good. I think we're fine. No Chaos Emperor, we go for Harpy Lady or Harpy Lady Sisters with equip cards. Mystic Tomato. Tomato. Labyrinth Wall. Here we go. 3000 Defense, let's fucking go. Alright, that's it. Oh, also, of course, the GOAT Imperial Order. You Sky Striker? Yeah, uh, well, we are not playing with Sky Striker legal, unfortunately, so. So let's go with Hole and Chain Energy. I don't know about anybody else, though, so. We're just gonna stick with this. This deck is terrible, but um... Burger Techie, I'm not running the fucking burger, dude. Okay? Must be. I I I want to. Usually Yo, just gamers, awful. gamers, let's go, let's go. Oh. We ready? Are we good? Oh, we ready? We good. good. I've been ready, Nux. Don't come in here with all that hostility. I've been ready. The hype is real. Okay. Let's go. Okay. Let's go. Uh, let's do it. All right. So, yeah, okay, 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 okay. I have, I have, I have the bracket. I have okay, the bracket. let's go. Let's yeah. go. In the okay. top left corner, we have... Dan. TDM. Versus... Zentraya. Whoa! Bug. Oh, is that your delingo? For, uh, <laughs> bottom left, we have Briggs. Versus... Tekken 101. Oh, oh, oh no! Oh no! Let's go, brother. Let's For go. top He's right, not, not yeah. being swag in the first round. Please. For right. top right, we have Mary. Further, Nuxtaku. Oh! Yes. And finally, yes. that leaves <laughs> Tectone with me, Swag Kage, in the bottom right. Yeah. Let's go, baby. I'm gonna kill you, Nox. I'm gonna oh. kill you. Oh, this is gonna be nuts. All right, Mary, this is going to be insane. It is. I hope you're ready for the I am ready. of a lifetime. Oh my god, I'm a little terrified, but this is gonna be nuts. So, mm, oh, yeah, this maybe. is gonna be rough. Oh, the male VTuber battle. Would you look at that? Oh my god, are you ready? I am. Um, I'm gonna kill you, Nox. You know. Okay. No. <laughs> I'm ready to duel. What is this travesty? Hello. Oh, that's a big gorilla boy. Okay, all right, all right, okay, yes. all right. Upstart goblin. All right, I'll gain you a can thousand. I activate pot of greed. I oh can my draw God, two. This is gross. This is so gross. Okay. Uh, delinquent duo. Oh my God! <laughs> this is gross. <laughs> all right. All right. I end my turn. Oh my God! This is gross. All right, let's go. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna be setting a card face down. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm gonna activate level limit area B. Uh, I'm gonna set one and end. <sighs> set a card and end my turn. All right, I'll draw. All right, nice. I'm gonna set a card. I'm gonna flip summon the swarm of locusts. Once per turn, when this card is when, when this card is flip summoned, destroy a spell or trap on the field. I'll be hitting that one. I might as well activate it and yep. I target your. Face down. Fair enough. Uh, main phase two, Swarm of Locust effect. That once per turn, I could set it. You're up. I set a card oh, and then my turn. Fun, fun. I'll draw. Ooh. Flip, summon, Swarm of Locust. Destroy the other one. Uh, what is this deck, Nox? 
It's a, it's a, it's a good one. I'm gonna set ah. one and reset Swarm of Locusts and end my turn. It's getting fun, it's getting fun! I draw. I flip summon the Swarm of Scarabs! When this card is flip summoned, I can target one monster on the field and destroy it! Be rid of you! Uh, I will then be resetting Swarm of Scarabs due to his second ability. All right, you're up, Gaber. I am the superior duelist! Okay, all right. Amazing! This is gonna be a fun turn. I'm gonna start with flip summoning Swarm of Locusts to destroy this spell or trap. And then I'm gonna be flip summoning another Swarm of Locusts to destroy this spell or trap. I am then gonna be flip summoning Swarm of Scarabs to destroy this monster. I'm gonna be resetting my bugs. And then I'm gonna be ending my turn. You're up. You pulled giant a giant trunade. You actually pulled a giant trunade? Right. Be gone with them! That's rough. That is rough. Flip summon Berserk oh, Gorilla. Rough. Flip summon Mad Dog of Darkness. Oh, this and is flip rough. summon Getsufuma. Get Alright. I attack this card. Yep. I attack this card. Yep. And I attack this card. Yep. Uh oh. Uh -oh. my turn. All right, I draw. Uh, I am then going to be putting Limit Lair a little B back down. I am then going to be setting one, setting two, and my turn. Mm. I am activating Needle Ceiling. Four or more monsters on the field destroy all face up monsters. Yes, 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 yes. Nice, I draw. We flip summon the swarm of scarabs to destroy your monster. <clears throat> I'm not having fun. Oh, but I am, my child. I'm going to be setting a card, and I'm going to be attacking you for only a thousand damage. Only a thousand damage, bro. Wait, That's before cool. you do anything, I use trap dust. Shoot! Show me your goddamn hand. This is revenge for the delinquent duo. Let's see it. You got painful choice. Yes. That's kind of rough, but I can only do it on monsters, so I guess put blue eyes back, right? All right, good stuff, good stuff. Painful choice. <laughs> okay. Uh, you can have Soul Tiger. Set. And I, I wonder what it is. I draw. I flip summon Scarabs to destroy it. <laughs> I flip summon Camel to draw a card. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, I'll attack you directly with Deslacuda and with Swarm of Scarabs, another thousand damage. Then in main phase two, I will reset them. You know how it is. <gasps> no! Dark hole. How have you gotten all of these cards? I don't understand! Dark I guess hole! I, I guess I picked packs you guys didn't. Alright, uh, I'm gonna be flip summoning Swarm of Scarabs number three. <laughs> <laughs> to destroy this. Hmm. Main face. Uh -huh. I flip summon stuff back. Ooh, okay. You take a thousand damage. Yep. Battle face. Oh. Needle ceiling. Four monsters. Destroy all face up monsters. That's I stealth. See. And that's that would be stealth bird. Alright, my go. Right now. Alright, so I'm gonna use Ray Jackie Break this time. I am going to discard Dark Dust Spirit to destroy my own le level, level limit area B. I am then going to tribute Swarm of Scarabs for Dark Dust Spirit. I'm going to be flip summoning these two. Okay, uh, I'll be attacking with all of them. Okay, bye, Nox. <sighs> GG, man. Not GG. <laughs> Not GG. No. no! You don't you don't, you don't get a GG Nox. <laughs> Man, I was looking forward to playing old school Yu-Gi-Oh! and then I, you pull a level limit area B on me. I just killed a bit. <laughs> <laughs> See you around, Nox. Thank you for inviting me. Of course, man. Alright, so the first match will be me and Briggs. How you feeling, buddy? I'm excited. I think, honestly, I'm very happy to be dueling you. I think it'll be a good duel. But now I will go into my Kaiba character, you third-rate duelist. Yeah, well, I have Barry next to me cosplaying as Yugi, so bring it on, Kaiba! Oh my god, Barry is the ancient pharaoh from 1,000 years I'm, ago. I'm, yeah, I'm Yugi, he's a temp. He's actually a brick. 
from the pyramid. <laughs> he is. He is. All right. All right. I'm going wrong, right, right, so like always. Let's let's do it. Let's do it. Oh, oh no! All right. Okay. Bruh. Right, Rock so beats paper. paper. I don't know what the hell this game is. I I'm gonna take it. I'm going first. Then I'm going to set one. Set this face down. And I will end my turn. Go for it, buddy. I will start my turn. Okay, by go for it. Setting a card. Okay. I am gonna activate wave motion cannon. Okay, well on activation of that, I'm going to activate Secret Barrel! Okay, I have taken the lead for what it matters. Okay. Wave motion cannon is scary though. I'm gonna set a card. I'm gonna activate level limit. Okay. And I will end my turn. I am going set another card. Riveting game. Play. Very insane game right now. Game right now. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna activate Delinquent Duo. Son of a bitch! So you got my Gravekeeper's Cannon Holder. Yeah, I'll just send another Gravekeeper's Cannon Holder. <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna activate Painful Choice. Son of a deck. Yeah, I'm gonna select Roulette Barrel. All right. I'm gonna set a card. Okay. And end my turn. All right, so start uh, the standby main. I'm going to set and then cool. end my turn. On your standby phase, I'm going to activate Coffin Cellar. Uh, each time a monster of yours is destroyed, uh, you take 300 damage. Now Fighting. I'm at four. Right. What are you, yep, what are you gonna do? And you're gonna do it? I am going to- Here it comes. Send it to the grave for 4,000. You're blowing your load. <laughs> oh! All right, ow. Ow. And then I will activate another wave motion cannon. <laughs> In response to that, I activate time seal. You can't it? draw on your next All right. draw phase. I'm going to normal summon this. Oh my god. Okay. I'll go to defense one anyway. I, I, I fucked I, up. I, I, I have, no, I have I limit have no B, idea. area B on. Yes, level limit area B. Yep. So if I were to flip these into attack mode, just for fun, what yeah, ends up happening is they go to defense mode. That's what happens, I guess, to with the... Uh, yeah, change all... All right, I'm going to flip summon this as well, and it goes to defense okay. mode. Oh, magical merchant. Good, oh, good. It doesn't go to defense mode. I fucked up. No, that's less than... Yeah, it's only one star, so you're oh. good. Well, I'm, I'm uh, yeah, I you threw. can't change it. Well, I cannot. Yeah. I, I messed up. It's fine. Um, it's fine. So I activate cards until I get a spell or trap. Uh, I, I got a spell, so. right? So I get that. My bad. I'm. I've you never used this energy. card before. Okay. And then chain. the roulette barrel goes to my graveyard. So I might actually oh, oh, take. That roulette barrel. Yeah. Yeah, okay. I take 300 damage. Okay. Yep. Go ahead. Okay. End your turn. Yeah. Oh my god, I gotta start doing something here, but that damn wave motion cannon! There's no removal I have! Okay. Okay. I'm going to flip summon Spirit Reaper. Ooh. He has three stars, 300 attack. The first battle phase, I'm going to attack your magical merchant. And if you do time. damage to me, you get to I, discard. Have, I'm gonna activate rec rec rush, rush Recklessly, though. Rush Recklessly, okay. So your magical merchant gets 700, so he's at 900, so I will take uh 600 damage but spirit reaper cannot be destroyed by battle yes i end my turn i'm gonna Three. set a card okay and i'm going to activate chain energy oh god what does this do um anytime oh, you oh, okay for anything right, you do pretty much you gotta do 500 life points and end my turn part of the cards guide me i'm gonna set a card End my turn. All right, I will on start. your standby phase. Okay. Also, <laughs> wait, wait, wait. This... I think for both sets, give thousand. Uh, oh, I points. lose a thousand. Okay. Yeah, because you All did right. two I cards. Lose a... Th that's fine. On your standby phase. Okay. I activate Raigeki Break. Discard one card from my hand. Target one card on the field and destroy it. Oh my God! What the fuck is this? Oh god, I knew they'd be playing this bullshit. This is literally Mystic Mine. Time seal. Dude, no fun allowed, bro. <laughs> so I'm going to discard Gravekeeper's Guard, and I'm going to target and destroy Wave Motion Cannon with Dragecki Break. Nice. So I somehow avoided dying to that, but I'm still not in a good position here. I'm going to activate oh, boy. Mm. another Chain Energy. I'm going to uh, Chain uh, Magic Drain. Uh, you have to discard one spell to negate the effect of this card. If you can't, then it's the son of a bitch. There Briggs. you go. Okay. He only has one card in his hand. What are the odds? It's a spell. And <laughs> the odds are pretty good. Matter of fact. Okay, great. 
All right, I know what I'm gonna do now. I am right. gonna activate Raigeki Break <laughs> ah, ha, ha. on my right. own card. Wait! I'm going to send Gravekeeper's Watcher to the graveyard. Uh, during either player's turn, when an opponent activates a spell or trap card or monster effect that could make them discard when it resolves, you can send this card from your hand to the graveyard, negate the activation, and if you do, destroy it. Wow. That is such a... I was... That was like the worst Gravekeeper. I'm like, what is this going to come in? I was going to use it to destroy what? level limit area B so we can fight. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so you know. sorry, bro. I'm going to activate it's all right. it's wave okay. motion cannon. Son of a... Okay, it's all right. It's okay. You got okay. all three. I did. I all really right. pulled until I could get three. And then I'm like, I'm just going to play okay. defense. It's unfortunate that you had nothing to get rid of my wave motions. Yeah, up until I did, but not enough, unfortunately. And you put another counter on there, and yeah. it's the same situation we're in before, unless I can draw another Raigeki break. I do have another one. I could um, send it, but I will not. I'm just going to end my turn. You got rid of my only way to get rid of level limit. I'm dead anyway, might as well. I activate... Well, no, it doesn't... Wait, does chain energy work for... No, it only yeah. after no, no, it's only if I set a magic or spell card. Set or activate take, from his or her respective hand. Or so you, activate cards. There yes. it is. Okay, yeah. So, so I take a thousand. thousand. I take a thousand. Okay, I'm gonna lose this duel, everybody. But I wanted to play Necro Valley so hard because that was the card Hi. I looked at to try to find so bad. And it took me 60 draws to finally get it. Let's go. I have, I have Necro Valley. I activate Necro Valley. Woo! I pay another thousand to activate Necro Valley. I'm down to 400 life points. And now all my Gravekeepers gain 500 attack and defense, which they cannot use because you have level limit area B. I end my turn, and the coup de gras is yours, Briggs. I start my turn, and I will send Wave Motion wave Cannon, motion to, the graveyard. cannon to the graveyard. And with that. You win, good sir. Good game, my friend. Good there game. There it is. I'm shaking your hand across the miles. There you go. Good it was, job. It was, it was a pleasure, Captain. All right. GG's, GG's. See you, man. Thank you, and congratulations. Oh, hey, hi, hello. Well, Lord Nuxenor here, coming to tell you that, yes, this video is as convoluted and difficult to put together as it seems, and it would not have been possible without the epic gamers over at Surfshark. So, if I could take your attention for just 60 seconds of your time to let you know what these mad lads do, Surfshark is a VPN, a virtual private network. Something that pretty much every single person on the planet should have. Everyone is living online these days, with social media being such a large part of everything we do. VPNs give you the privacy you need, and none do it better than Surfshark. Another added bonus for VPNs, gamers, you could place yourself virtually anywhere in the world. Are, are you aware of how insane that is? You want to watch a show that's on Netflix, but only in certain countries? Well, poof, you could virtually be there. Or the same with everything else. Now, something that most people are unaware of is many services give you different prices depending where in the world you live. So if you want YouTube Premium, it's cheaper in third world countries. So if you Surfshark VPNify yourself to put yourself there, you're going to get a better deal on many of the services that you could get. VPNs are huge. It's super Super easy to use. It just shows up in your Google Chrome Fingo that takes two clicks. And to get it, click the link in the description here. Surfshark.deal slash Nuxtaku is another way to get there. And this is a deal the likes of which you will never see ever. You're getting 83% off and three months of free usage where you can always just cancel your subscription then. It's honestly a steal, literally. I can't get over how amazing Surfshark is and I appreciate them so much for all their support as well as for being a great service. Anyway, thank you all for your support and allowing me to make the content I truly love and not get lambasted for it monetarily by accepting ads and working with really cool people. So back to the video all right so we we need to choose rock paper scissors i'm just going middle we won i think we want to go first fuck <laughs> oh let's go first oh my god we we drew it first uh, they want to do this we draw one this should be fine now. So they're up to 9,000, and then I'm going to end my turn, I think. Yeah. 
What is this? This guy can make a second attack during each battle phase. Oh, no way. Good. Oh, no, they did this. Inflict 600 points to your opponent's life points. Pot of green it is. And I end my turn. No, that's not what I needed. That is not what I needed. I'm going to end my turn. All right. I end my turn. Hail underscore boops up to tier one. Let's go. Zenta high. That's not good. Destroy the one face that monster your opponent controls as the lowest attack. I okay. Will destroy your nimbo. Okay, so this is if you have a spell card in your hand, you can discard it to stop my trap working. Otherwise, my trap will negate your fissure. <laughs> oh, they did it as well. Oh god, I they can you directly. This is bad. It can do and two with attacks. This card, it means I can attack you twice. <sighs> and I and my turn. Got it. Oh. The summon Harpy Lady and then activate Elegant Egotist, which allows me to summon this. Holy fuck. I'm going to attack the Zapper with Harpy Lady Sisters. And I'm going to end my turn. I'm feeling confident. Ah, right. I end my turn. Yes. Mystical Elf. Nice. I'm going to set a monster. Attack the middle monster with Harpy Lady Sisters. And end my turn. I end my turn. Heart of the cards. That's not heart of the cards. I will attack the monster you just put down face down with Harpy Lady Sisters. Then search. They've got the strats. I didn't realize you'd be able to search that, but because it's got such low defense, you can do that. F. Uh, I end my turn. I am going to tribute. I will send Giant Soldier to the grave. Next up, I will use Summon Skull to attack the Harpy Lady Sisters. And then I end my turn. That'll flip and do as well. I'm gonna set a card face down. I'm gonna activate Paralyzing Potion and equip it to your Summon Skull, which means it can't attack. And I end my turn. I end my turn. Oh, let's go. Let's go. I'm going to activate Pot of Greed, which allows me to draw two cards. I'm going to end my turn. Going to flip this card. So I'm going to send back my Summon Skull to my hand. Okay, that destroys my Paralyzing Potion. And I will tribute the monster I just used. I will use some skill and attack your Harpy Lady. Okay. And then I end my turn. Yeah, I'm gonna set this card. I'm gonna activate Dark Hole, which destroys all monsters on the field. Since you destroyed this monster, I am allowed to summon a Muscler with 1,500 or less attack. So I can do the same with Witch of the Black Forest that I just destroyed as well. So I'm going to banish Thunder Dragon and Witch of the Black Forest. 
to special summon Chaos Emperor Dragon. Oh fuck. And then I'm gonna attack you directly. Well, shit. <laughs> uh. That is a beast of a fucking monster. Oh. I don't think it's worth popping it. This is actually fucking insane. I'm just gonna attack. I'm learning. You have attacked my face down called Cyber Jar. Yep. Which destroys all monsters on the field. I'm gonna go to my main phase two. I'm gonna set this. And then Emma turn. I'm going to activate Dark Hole. Which destroys all monsters on the field. Then I am going to summon. I don't know how to say this person or card's name, but I'm gonna use it to attack your life points directly. We're in trouble, guys. Then I end my turn. I'm gonna normal summon Harpy Lady. I'm gonna activate Malevolent Nuzzler to increase its attack to 2000. And then I will attack your Maha Velo. Which should be 450. I activate rush. Okay, I'm gonna activate Fairy's Hand Mirror, which allows me to change the target of your rush recklessly. So I'm gonna change it to my Harpy Lady. <laughs> so I'm gonna change it to should be 2,700 then. So you will lose 1,150 life points. Clutch. We did it. We clutched up. And Emma Tim. I'm going to summon Chaos Sorcerer. And discard one light card. And one dark. Vanished. I had my turn. Is actually not a great card to have. Change of heart. And then I'm gonna I'm gonna sacrifice it. So you can just send it straight to the graveyard. Because I'm gonna sacrifice it for uh this. And then I'm gonna attack you directly. I activate my trap card. Okay, cool. Bell biting circle. I'm gonna summon Dark Elf. And I'm going to attack your life points with it. I am going to activate Dark Call, which allows me to discard one card from my hand, but also targets one of your face up. Monsters on the field and banishes them. And I will banish Dark Elf. Yeah, I'm going to activate Nobleman of Crossout, which targets one face down monster on the field and destroy it. And then I'm going to normal summon Nimble Momonga and attack you with it. And end my turn. I end my turn. Nimble Momonga and Thunder Dragon to summon Wing Weaver and attack your face down. Well, it was a good run. And my turn. Unfortunately, I have no more cards to use in my hand which would help me, so I admit defeat. Good game. Good game. Good game. Thank you for the game. Good luck, dude. Yep, good luck to you too, buddy. Oh! Alright, cool. You get to go first. Let's go! Alright. First, baby. Huge. Uh, also, you get to draw going first, so just draw one card. Oh, yeah. I did. Good right, luck, gamer. Cool. Yep. Good luck, buddy. Um, I'm gonna normal summon giant rat and attack. 
All right. So I flip to reveal. Yes. You take a thousand damage due to stealth burst. Yes, flip I take thirteen hundred. Thirteen hundred. Oh my god. You love to see it, dude. You love yeah. To all right. See well. Okay. Uh, uh huh. Gonna play swords. Uh huh. And we're gonna play. So now you have to pay five hundred life points to attack me. Fuck. I'm gonna set this bad boy. Yeah. Good luck, gamer. Thanks, buddy. Uh, so. And I'm yeah, fucked. we're gonna set this. Love Go ahead and burn that. me for a thousand more, bro. All right. So then I will flip. Yep. I'll you lose take a, thousand. a grand, and then I'm gonna reflip. Yep. That's all, all right. you. Flip some in Cyber Jar. So I will attack Boganian with Giant Rat. Yeah. Huh? Love and to see then, it. monster face down. And then I'm gonna activate the thing. Okay. I'm gonna special summon in attack mode a Chaos Sorcerer. I'm gonna use its effect to banish your rat. All right, work. All right, now this, this shit dies. Okay. And then I'll end my turn. Okay, in response to you ending your turn, I will activate my solemn wishes. I'm going to normal summon my Boganian. Boom! Yeah. All right, so he's going <laughs> to okay. flip up, and he is probably going to destroy, destroy that. one monster. I don't want to do this, but uh, I think I have to blow up the Boganian. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Attack! Right. Magician of Faith is gonna add Pot of Greed. Enter. Yeah. Set this card. Face okay. card. Bug. Alright, I'm gonna normal summon Big Fucking Gorilla. Okay. Attack yeah. this fucking thing. Alright. I'm going to attack. So, Mystic Tomatoes effect, when it's sent to the graveyard, lets me special summon a dark monster. I will attack. We're gonna summon Crass Clown. I'm gonna flip, and I'm gonna take your Crass Clown. I end turn here. So I'll do that. Alrighty. Normal summon... This guy is on Beer of the Dark. Attack... The Dream Clown. I'm gonna do Threatening Roar. Yeah. So yeah, I will. Okay, so I'm gonna activate smashing ground on your zombie of the dark. I will attack with my berserk gorilla. Uh, nimble momonga gets me a thousand, and yep. then lets me summon two nimble momongas from my deck. So then I will attack there. All right. So that's a thousand more. Yeah. A thousand more, and you have to pay 500 for each of those. Yeah. Yeah, I'll check that's okay. All right. All right. All right, so I'm going to pay 500 here, 500 here. Normal summon for 500. Uh-huh. And then I will end. Okay. During the draw phase, I'm going to activate Rivalry of Warlord. I'll keep everything from my Chaos Sorcerer. Oh, okay, yeah. then I will banish your card. Okay. Just set a monster. Me. All right, so I'm going to banish my own Chaos Sorcerer. Okay. Flip my Stealth Bird. And then I'm going to flip it back. Yeah, I think you got it. So all you have to do is flip them and I I die. Start and then flip, right? Yep. Oh my, oh my god. god! You got it! Oh my god! Yo! That was a fucking, fucking sick, sick fucking, fucking game! game. Yeah, oh, I know, that was, that fun, was fun as hell. hell. That, that was, was unbelievable! Play, buddy. 
This right, hand so is not I nearly get... as good as my last one. My hand is terrible, don't worry. Good, good. Mop. Mop. Oh, damn. That's a good card. <laughs> All right. <laughs> my girl. Let's go. Yo. All right. Woo. We'll set one. Set. There we go. Thanks. Trap does shoot. Activate only if your opponent has four more cards in their hand. Look at their hand. Select a monster. Return it to the deck. So let me see your hand. Oh! Imagine. The imagine being this fucking ugly, dude. Imagine that. And the one I'm going to be getting rid of is Chaos Sorcerer. Uh, to the deck. All right. I'm going to play. Huge. Three, the Braid Wanderer. No! I attack. Attack your fucking man eater bug. You take 300 what damage. The? And what? when Gravekeeper's Spy is flipped, I can special summon a Gravekeeper's Monster from my deck. Yeah, fuck you, dude. Wow. Get smashed. Die. Bye-bye. Coward. All right. Go. All right, my go. Ooh, I like that. That's good. I'm going to set a card. Yep. And uh, I'm going to end my turn. Big Chungus of Darkness. Cute. Cute. Alright. There you go. Ripper Roo. I draw. Good stuff. Uh, I am going to start things off strong by flip Flipping summoning the Grave Creeper's yep. Guard. I already called that and before. And putting you him even back in your hand. <laughs> yeah, saw that coming 10 million away. miles away. Yeah. There it I'm kind of scared of that face down, to be honest. Alright, whatever. I'm going to attack with Grave Keeper's Guard. Uh, great, I'll take a thousand. Good. You happy? Yeah. Main phase two, I'm gonna tribute guard to set a card. Set a card, and in my turn. You're up! Excellent, dude. Normal summon this fucker. Nice. <laughs> oh, Ray, no way, you have him. No way, wow. Yeah, and then I'm gonna play Soul Release and banish everything in your graveyard. Here's and I'll banish uh, this fucking guy. Go. Huge. Uh, I'll draw. I am going to start things off by flip uh, summoning the Guardian Sphinx. Oh, uh, here we go. When this guy is flip summoned, return all monsters your opponent controls to the hand. So that's this guy. It's what we do here. During the battle phase, I attack you directly with Sphinx. Nice, Dude, nice. bro. Main phase Dude. two. Do you know what Sphinx's other effect yeah. is? Flip him back down, bro. Yay! <laughs> Woo! Yeah, baby! That's what we're waiting for. I'll set another one and end. Poggers, bro. Poggers. Nice. Ah, uh, you got it. You win. <laughs> I submit. I submit. <laughs> this is so sad. I want the game to go longer. I will go first, and we're playing with a draw, apparently. Yeah, yeah. So, person goes first, draws, right? Manually draw. All right, I am going to set a card. I am going to set a card. I'm going to activate chain energy and end my turn. Nice. Do you pay to set as well? Okay. I'm going to pay the 500. Okay. To set this. Here we go. I'll start my turn. Wait, I'm, so I'm, what I'm going to do is I'm going to flip some in my bird. Declare its effects, so you take a thousand damage. I'm gonna normal summon this card and pay 500. And I will, in my battle phase, attack you. The money, a bug. Which card are your you destroying? Solar flare. Yeah, your solar flare. Solar flare to the graveyard. Uh, I'll attack you directly for 700. Uh, once per turn, you can change this card to face down defense position. So I will set it again and end my. Yeah, I'll end my turn. I'm gonna activate Upstart Goblin, so plus a thousand draw one. I'm gonna activate another one. Okay. Uh, activate right. Dark Hole. Okay, cool. Normal summon this, which is 500, uh, right? Yes. I'm gonna activate Raide Raigeki Break on it. So okay. I'm gonna send my chain, other chain energy to the grave. <laughs> Why are you all playing Burn? I want to kill myself. <laughs> I mean, what else are they going to play? Why are you all playing Burn? <laughs> what else are they going to play? Realistically, I, I think the person who has... I looked through my bulk. I could not make anything else that was usable. I have to end. Yeah. All right, I'm going to set a card and end my turn. 
<laughs> I'm gonna use Thunder Dragon's effect. So discard it and grab up to two. Okay, I'm gonna activate Change of Heart. Grab your, grab your monster. Okay. Sacrifice it. Okay. Well, you, you pay 500 for the Change yep. of Heart and the summon. Activate Axe of Despair to add 500, uh, 1,000 attack. Damn. Pay 500 and then attack you directly. 2600? Yeah. And end my oh, turn. I need some fucking RNG, man. Alright, that works. All <laughs> oh, the gods. That works. Alright, I'm gonna activate Smashing Ground. Destroy the, the one face up monster your opponent controls. Alright, in my battle phase, I will attack you directly and I do take 500 more. Unfortunately, though, you can't even you can't play a card. I can't think. play nothing. Yeah, that's it. I can't play nothing. That's your game. You're good. I'll draw for the turn. Oh, he... <laughs> was that chaos at first? Right? <laughs> no. Oh. <laughs> oh no. GGS. GGS, oh. my friend. That was fun, bro. Yeah, that was fun. Thank you. Oh, oh damn. the papers. Okay. Oh, oh. All right. Okay. Okay. The match has been decided. Ooh, baby. This is going to well, be nice. you're obviously going first because you get the draw. That's right. I'm going to take it with pleasure. Oh, my God. It's such a bad hand. Oh, gross. Okay. Uh, oh, this is so nasty. All right. We're going to start off strong. Set one, set two, and you're up. Oh. Wow. I'm gonna activate the link with Duel, said, your favorite I, card. I don't press. <laughs> this is my least favorite card. Button oh, unless shit. I get fucking, you know, bribed. Oh, he's got the duel. Well, you're gonna get rid of this card right here. How about that? All right. And then another card of your choice. Better. Toll <gasps> and wave motion cannon. Got the burn cards are coming right? out. Um, I will Alex end my turn. Eight. Uh, not looking good. <laughs> All right. Uh, <laughs> I guess I'll set another and set another and end. Okay. No, I was just muting myself real quick. I will flip summon my Gravekeeper's Guard to send this back to your hand. Cool, cool. Mm. I'm gonna end my turn. Right. My draw. So I am going to be flip summoning Swarm of Scarabs to destroy yeah, this. Boy. There it is. Oh, nice, okay. All right, I'm gonna summon Pyramid Turtle. <laughs> I'm gonna pay 500 <laughs> life points for a toll to a tag this is stupid shithole of a card. Yeah. <laughs> Do I pay 500 to attack with Swarm of Scarab? It's just an extra. It's one less. It's not, not worth it. Not worth it. All right. In my main phase. Yeah, I know. I, I wanted to do it because I, I thought it was oh my Oh my god, life. you got snatched! You got Seema! Let's go! Are you joking? Let's go! The DM staples, bro. <laughs> it's broken. He, he got snatched shield and the link with duo. Those are like the two best cards in the game. All right, well, I'm yeah, going to attack your face down. I think it's Ordeal of a Traveler. Ordeal, baby. All right. And call the card, type of card. card, monster, spell, or trap. And if they call it wrong, return that. This is, uh, so one's a monster for sure. So I'm going to call it monster. You're right. I have to show you, right? Uh, yeah, I you think can so. hold over the card and click <laughs> review. Spy, yeah, cool, cool, cool. That's why I discarded a spy, by the way. Because yeah, I had another cool. spy. And I will end my turn. But no, I'm dude, just normal another turtle and crash go! into it for a free oh, plus shit. two. Go, go. I'm inside his mind, dude. Normal summon. Flip summon. Oh my god. Needle ceiling! Oh. Oh. Get out of here! Wow, dude. That okay. is so crazy. In my main oh. phase, in my main phase, I'm sending this to the graveyard. I am wow, going to banish god. a dark and a light. No! To summon oh God, monster, no, Chaos oh, Emperor oh, Dragon. You 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 can't you can't use the Chaos Emperor Dragon because you've activated the effect of Wave Motion Cannon. Rip. Okay. Well, um, that's unfortunate. I end my turn. All right, my go. A mess. Two. Oh, set for that. Smile. Your move, bro. Hope you don't draw mm. something good. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna declare the effect. <laughs> <laughs> Wow. So 15 damage. And the duel and has the been simplified game basically state. reset. I'm pretty sure Nux's deck is better in a simplified game state. All right. Heart of the cards. Top deck. Let's go. Yada, you go. go. Oh, set pass. Ooh, yeah. Set one pass. I'm going to normal summon a shining angel. Oh, and no, attack no, you directly, Nuxie boy. 
shield. Prop. That is such a good no. top deck. And, and I will on my turn. No! You're up. Is that unfortunate? You're That's up. That's unfortunate for you. Oh, oh. Wait, just the normal, normal pass. I'm gonna oh, I'm gonna oh, 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 I'm gonna attack you with my with my solar flare. Oh, you went solar flare first. Okay, take my. Oh, or deal of a traveler. Okay. Oh wow. I want? will, without a doubt in my mind, call a spell. You have to reveal and confirm it. Yeah. It's a trap. Trap. I'm surprised you didn't put a regular trap. Trap. In all, in all honesty, I would have called monster there. Nux literally big brained that. Yeah. Yeah, I, I had to do it. To this. That goes back okay. to hand. Back I will to attack you directly with this. to see another turn. Jesus. One more turn for you, my friend. It I will seems end my so. All right, let's go. Come, Come on, heart of the cards. No! Well, I'm gonna, set, I'm gonna set the right Jackie card. break though, that's for sure. Yeah, you're full of shit. Well, I, I mean, at least at least card. he doesn't auto die, so. This card will attack you directly? Yeah. Monster spell or trap? I'm gonna call trap first, because I know Noxy Boy. You are, you are correct. Oh yeah. shit! Wow. Oh shit! <laughs> Read right. like an open fucking book! That's GG. Right. Uh, that's I how still lose. Works. That's not how that works. But yeah, that is how that doesn't works. matter. That, that is how that works. He's allowed. He's allowed to chain the Regeki break to the. Uh, no, I will still attack you directly. Ordeal, and then on resolution. Yes, game. Yes, Let's that game. is legal. Uh. All right, Brigo's up 1-0 over Nux. Let's uh. see if Nux is able to reverse sweep, or if Nux is going to find himself losing in the finals of his own tournament. Okay. Moment of truth. Good luck, boys. Thanks, man. All right, I'm gonna start with. Setting this and this. Um, you're up. <laughs> Trap does shoot. Let's see it. Any revealers oh. of the hand? Though. That's an annoying hand, don't you think? Kevin, you uh... chain energy, yeah, gravekeeper spy, I'll... knight assailant, wave motion cannon, roulette barrel, and toll. Bye. Yeah. On my turn, I will set a card. I wish I had some some damage. I just I'm gonna right. activate wave motion cannon. I will activate yeah. toll, and then I will activate yeah. chain energy, and I will end my turn. Oh my god! Oh, I, don't... I am this going is to flip dude. summon gravekeeper spy to special summon guard. I'm gonna summon a guard. I'll pay a thousand for one set card and a second set card. Is this whatever? Sure. Yeah. All right. All right. Let's see the night assailant. Damn it. Take another eight hundred. I take thir thirteen hundred damage because I also needed to pay for the attack. Ah, <laughs> uh, I am going to proceed to end my turn. Your move breaks. Yeah. Playground Play rules. Play <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! I will pay five hundred for that. I'm gonna roll a two. Cool. Why are you rolling so many times? What is, what is happening? Oh my god, he gets to pop a level four. Once per no, turn. No, he rolled! Oh, this no, guy. One, once per turn, you can roll a six-sided die twice. Choose one result and destroy one monster. Get fucked. Nerd. Yeah, it... Destroy this guy. Okay. Wow, dude. Roulette viral coming in clutch. Let's go. Oh my Bro, god. Bro, actually rolling the four on the two die rolls, that's insane. That's what dude, he means. Every single morning, I get on my knees and I pray to R and Alright, stop talking about it. R and Jesus. R and Jesus. <laughs> hey, I'm trying to make content for your YouTube video here, Nux. While I beat you at Yu-Gi-Oh, what? Ah, we got a lose, because you have to wait motion cannons! And I will end my turn. I'm gonna needle ceiling, actually. I fucking called his death, dude. Yeah. I'll face up monsters, okay. Yeah. I'm confused. Flip but... summon guard to the hand. Okay. You I pay 500 to attack with guard. Yeah. Well, normal summon. Oh, mm. big one thousand. Main two, I'll pay another 500, wait. Do I lose Ooh. the wave motions? No. <laughs> All right, pay another 500. <laughs> set it oh, on the guard. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not gonna set it. Go. Okay, to be fair, Break has opened literally Exodia. Yeah, this is literally Exodia right here. That was actually just the best hand. Pushing okay, Break, like, be here. honest with us right now. Did you literally go into this like, uh, like pack opening like with the idea to just Pull all the fucking burn cards. Yeah, I, I went in. I had a deck. <laughs> I had a I had a deck constructed. Oh, yeah. I'm like, in order to beat Nux, I need to be more annoying, more toxic. Wow. So what wow. I did. You're literally, you're literally out here like, okay, cool. So I'm gonna try to pull triple wave motion. I'm going to try to pull triple toll. Try to. Yeah, pull you triple just triple wanted to be the most obnoxious. I, uh, I spent 35 I packs. I spent 35 packs on a wave motion cannon. 
I hate that it actually fucking paid off. That is the thing that frustrates me the most. Well, like, I hate is... that he drew two of them! <laughs> Alright. In my battle phase, I am going to attack your guard. You take 400. So my, I'm currently at 3,000 uh, if I discard my wave motion cannon. That could be a scarab to fuck me over or one of them right now. I'm going to send the 2,001 to the grave. That's uh, big burn, baby. Uh, you know what they big say, mommy raised no bitch. I'm not going to hold on to one. I'm going to take another 1,000. Oh! Oh, no! No! Yeah, I think that was correct. I genuinely think that was the right play. Dude, what do you Scarab mean? Scarab destroys <laughs> Angel. Yo, you see, he was fine. He was. He I would have been fine. All right, I'm gonna reset Scarabs. <laughs> um, no, definitely not. Attack. Yeah, no, definitely not. Um, okay. The thing is, I want to use something for my hand, but I'm gonna have to pay for chain energy. It's so, gonna cost you. You know what? I'm gonna do it. In case you draw a Solar Flare Dragon, because I know you have that, I'm gonna pay 500 for level limit area B. Oh wow! wow. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna end my turn. Yeah. I'm a normal summon Death Koala and attack oh, you. Oh, oh, the counter! Level 3! I'm in pain. I take 500. Pain. Why Why would you, you just pay. set that? You win next turn. No, he destroys it with his scarab. Oh, wow, true, wow. true, 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 true. I'm bad at the game. Don't ask me. I don't know. <laughs> and I will end my turn. What's the move here? I don't know. I, I only have I, I only have one more summon. <laughs> you have <laughs> literally one more play in the game. I have one that's more play. Like, that's where you're at. Genuine thinking about the total like cards in their deck, I cannot fathom a way for Nux to win this. If he sets, he can't play another card for the rest of the game. And he decks out first. Yeah. Like, well, like, pretty what is much. Uh, there is no out for Nux. Yeah, yeah, I pretty much lost. I lost. Go. You uh, cannot play another I card. I win this turn, I think. Yep. Yeah. It's over. I can normal summon Solar Flare. Oh, yeah, that's oh, it. Wow. Oh, and just go to the end phase. Like, that's Take it. 500 <laughs> and end my turn. Yeah, just end, end my turn. Oh, shit. Oh, the winner! Two O. Yeah, two O, oh, oh, dude. Man. Good games, boys. GGs. Yeah, that was a great game. GG's, my friend. Thank dude, you, for, thank you, you so much for having me in the tournament. Of course, man. I couldn't do it without you. You don't understand something. You don't understand that, A, all I wanted was to be in the content the whole way through, okay? So I made it to the finals. God damn it, it's huge. <laughs> I'm so proud of myself. <laughs> At least I made it to the finals of my own tournament. I didn't get absolutely clapped in the first round. I know I had to build a degenerate toxic deck, but that's just who I am. A toxic degenerate. No, that that's definitely not the life lesson I want to give here. But you get the point. The point is you should be subscribing for future tournaments. Part two of this masterpiece as well as other things that I managed to somehow scrape together. Give some love to everyone that participated. Link in the description, of course, to Tectone, Briggs, Dan, Mary, Swag, Teching, Zen, Farfa, and Distant Coder. Check out my weekly Yu-Gi-Oh! series that I've been doing kind of just for fun, shits and giggles with Briggo, which is what made this final battle so insane. It's been on my second channel. I upload weekly, Nuxanor. Check it out, link in the description. If you want to help support the channel, feel free to pick up some merch at nuxtaku.com. Subscribe for future stuff. You may not be aware of this, but the night before I actually threw this tournament, I did not sleep. Like, I was up all night just thinking about how things would go wrong. Because, like, I had so many dropouts last minute due to, like, their birthday. You know, you can't blame them. All of a sudden, their partner th throwing them a birthday party. Obviously, that takes precedence. You know, real life at the end of the day is more important than card games. I mean, at the end of the day, they're clearly third-rate duelists with fourth-rate decks. But, like, hey, I'm not going to be the one to step in their way. So, scheduling this has been... It's been difficult, <laughs> to put it bluntly, which is now, in retrospect, why no one else has ever done it. But I'm crazy enough to do it again. And even on a bigger scale yet. Next time, it'll have a little twist to the rules as well. It's not going to be the same thing. Me run the same tournament twice, bruh. You should know me by now. And if you don't, you should watch my other stuff. The craziness is only just beginning. And any content creator that's interested in this kind of thing, feel free to hit me up at me on Twitter, leave a comment on the video. People that watch the video, share it around. Maybe you want certain content creators to join. If they're interested in this kind of thing, you could show it to them, show it to your friends, because this is stuff of history. And if I'm rambling about being proud of it for far too long in the outro, that's because I am proud of it and it was huge. And I'm patting myself on the back right now because I lost two nights of sleep over this. One before, nervous, and the second one after, just overexcited. <laughs> Thank you so much for all your support, gamers. Honestly.
I really appreciate being in the position that I'm actually able to do this stuff. It means a hell of a lot, and I appreciate all the people that participated, people that showed interest in participating, people that watched. Like, honestly, guys, th this is such a crazy timeline we live in, and I wanted to tell you all to remember to stay weird, fam.